Hey guys, are you having trouble mixing and mastering for Spotify and other streaming services, getting those levels right? Check out this quick video I filmed this morning. Morning guys, it's Tommy Notter. So while I'm, I'm just mixing through this song and I've come up with a little technique, um, I'm trying to get things leveled down for Spotify. So what I've done is gone into WLM Plus and I've made my own preset. And basically the presets you need for it is minus 16 on the shot, minus, sorry, minus 16, minus 32, minus 2, minus 14. And those are the bottom figures there. You want it on LUFS 9 dB. And <coughs> with this one, with the plus edition, you've got a little gain trim there. And basically what it does is, as I'm listening through this song from start to finish... I'll listen all the way through and I'll let it do its thing and it'll tell me the short term and the long term LUFS. But at the end of it all, it averages it out and if you're in 14 LUFS, then you're good for Spotify, that's your average over the whole song. But if you're a little bit over your average, then this trim knob here tells you exactly how much over and that's exactly how much Spotify is going to bump it down. So my aim for this is to keep adjusting until that trim knob reads as close to 0, 0.0 as possible. So it's a pretty good system. Um, I've just got my spectrum meter up here as well, just looking out for any stray peaks, but there is none. I've, I've gone through it all. So this is what I'm watching for now. We've got minus 20, obviously that's too low. Too low, too low, too low, and then when it comes back then it kicks in. And then you'll see this has got a trim knob here. The trim currently reads 4.8, so that means at that point in the song it's way too low. As the other elements come in and it starts compressing everything together, the LUFs start to read correct. Now my trim is saying minus 2.6. So over the whole average of the song, at the end of it, my last reading was 0 0.6. That's how much it's going to bump it down. I've just took a little more sub bass out of it, and I'm going to see what it reads at the end of this now. So that's my system for getting a good mix for Spotify. If you've got any questions, give me a shout. I think it's really interesting and a good way of doing things, especially now you've got the potential of... A streaming service turning your music down so you want to get it exactly right give me a show if you got any questions i might do an extended video on this but it's cool for now peace <laughs>